Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I really do apologise if the lighting on this video is absolutely terrible. Also, my hair is a really mess at the moment. But I actually wasn't going to film this video today because I've got home late from work. However, I've been really, really excited to open this box. So, here is a massive box. As you can see, it got wet. Um, the delivery driver left it outside behind the fence, even though I asked for it to be delivered to a neighbour. However, I'm hoping everything inside is perfectly fine. So yeah, this is gonna be an unboxing of an online shopping haul. I'm just gonna free up this chair to pop the box on and then I will show you guys what's in here and where it's from. So this is a haul of stuff from a brand called Cherries, which is like an online shopping store for things that you would find in like B&M, Home Bargains, places like that so honestly it was absolutely incredible this company actually reached out to me and everything in this box has been kindly gifted to me and also they have given me a discount code for you guys to use which is page louise 20 i'll pop it here and i do need to note however the only way you can use this code is to use the link down below in the description bar to download the app and then this code will give you 20 percent off anything you buy so I figured I would just show you what I've got. I'm so, so, so excited to open this. Like, honestly, I was gonna film this tomorrow because the lighting is terrible right now and all I wanted to do was go to bed. But then I got home from work, found this box ready and delivered and I was like, I'm filming this video tonight. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna grab the box. I'm really scared that it's gonna break because like, this is the bottom of the box right now. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna rip this tape off and open up. So if you've seen one of these videos before, you'll know that it comes with this really cute tissue paper, which has the Cherries logo all over it. If you haven't, this is what it looks like. And like I say, this box has fallen to bits, so I'm just gonna have to pop it on the chair next to me. So I'm just gonna pop the box sort of on this chair in front of me and just hope that nothing breaks. <laughs> so I'm just gonna take the paper off now. It is well packaged as well. So don't be worried about anything you might order. And as you can see, this is everything that I got. So the whole content, content, the whole contents of this box actually comes to fifty pounds, and that was including the delivery. Because at the time when I shopped online, it did have a delivery code for I think it was like your free, your first next day delivery was free with this code. I'm not sure if it'll still be on the website, but it's definitely worth checking out. If you're interested and yeah i'm just gonna start unboxing this now i am honestly so excited so the first things i picked up was just some easter eggs so i got two of these malteser ones these are the 80 gram ones and i think these were a pound each which i'm not mad about they come with the little malteser bunnies and then as you can probably see here i also got two of the dairy milk ones so there's them and then I got some Sensodyne toothpaste. Honestly, this is gonna be the most random haul you've ever seen. But like I say, this is basically just everything you can buy in like Home Bargains and B&M and places like that, except it's online. So it's more convenient if you don't have time to go shopping. And this honestly came within, I think it was like two days of me ordering. And I ordered quite late at night as well. So that obviously had an impact on when mine got delivered. But with the next day delivery, obviously you would get it next day. Um, depending what time you order. So the next thing I got was some Sensodyne toothpaste. This is the gentle whitening toothpaste and I use Sensodyne toothpaste all the time anyway so I figured I'd pop some of that on the order. I also got some Space Raiders. These are the beef flavour ones and if you watch my channel you know I follow Slimming World. So these I think are about four and a half sins. Haven't had them in a while so I might be a bit off on the sin count. I'll double check that before I have them but these are just a really nice healthier I say healthier, it's still crisps, but lower sin alternative for crisps if you fancy crisps on Slimming World. Also for Slimming World, I got some of the Alpen Light. These are the Jaffa Cake bars. I think these were also a pound, um, and I think also the Space Raiders were the pound. Can't remember the prices of absolutely everything, but if you have a look on the app, you'll find them anyway. But these are a healthy extra on Slimming World for two, or you can have one for three sins. And I just haven't love having these in my um, drawer at work just for a healthy snack. So figured I'd get some of the Alpen Light bars whilst I was shopping on the website. And then I just couldn't resist these. These are basically just unicorn gems. I'm not even sure how many sins they would be. Uh, it's 92 calories for a packet. So I think they'd be like five sins. Maybe like four and a half sins. But I'll look them up as well. But yeah, 
I love ice gems and I figured unicorn gems, why not? They look cute. So this is a random one, but I just got a nice scraper because I don't actually have a nice scraper in my car at the moment. And this is really weird, but the only thing I've been finding in my car to be able to scrape the ice off when it's really cold is an eyeshadow palette. So I figured I'd get a nice scraper so I can return the eyeshadow palette to my makeup collection and start scraping with something that's actually designed to scrape ice off of your car. <laughs> so this next thing, is an absolute essential in my life no matter how many times i buy these i always lose them i never know what i've done with them so i've just got a packet of hair grips just because like i say i must have spent hundreds of pounds on hair grips in the past and i always lose them i have no idea where they've gone so i figured i'd buy some more keep them in a tub and these were really cheap as well i think i think these could have been a pound and you get 200 hair grips so that's not bad at all really and yeah i've been needing some of these because i think i'm down to my last two so i will be having a video up on my channel soon of a hallway um sort of like a makeover for my hallway and for that we did buy a venetian style blind from the range which is one of the ones that you cut to fit just to go in the hallway window so when i was shopping on cherries i found this which is a venetian blind cleaner and i believe obviously like you put the bits of the blind through there you grip it and then you can like easily dust your blind so i just thought that would be handy for cleaning the blind off and this was also a pound i think i think most of these things were a pound maximum like two pounds um this there was one thing i bought which was about four pounds i think but i don't think i spent more than five pounds on anything there is some things that you can get which are slightly more expensive but obviously that's just the same as shopping in b m or home bargains but i think the majority of the things on the website were between like one to two pounds some less some slightly more so honestly it's an absolute bargain website that i definitely recommend you check out so the next thing is really random but we have kitchen scissors and they are honestly terrible like they don't cut anything so i found these when i was on the website which are just some pink spotty scissors i'm sure just she's gonna absolutely love them but at least we have some new kitchen scissors now and then i bought some scouring pads these are just stainless steel scourers just for obviously general cleaning and things there is actually a pan which i managed to really really burn and we would be needing some scourers but keep forgetting to pick them up so when i was looking through the website i saw these i figured i may as well get them and probably make josh's year because i'm going to be able to finally sort out the pen the pen not the pen finally sort out the pan that i um damaged and is no longer usable uh yeah so fingers crossed this is going to repair that the next thing I've got is these and I always use the command strips for hanging things on my wall because I actually rent where I live despite the fact we are allowed to decorate because the landlord is happy enough for us to do that and um, I don't want to like be drilling too many holes and things into the wall so I tend to use command hooks when I'm putting like pictures and things up also because I'm never that sure and if I want it there so at least if I use the command hooks it's a damage free way of hanging things and I can always like tape things down as I need to. So I thought I'd try these. These are a cheaper version. Like I think the command strips are like three to four pounds for a packet, sometimes more expensive. And I think these was a pound and you get four sets. So I'm gonna give these ones a go and see how well they work because I'm actually making a picture wall up my stairs in the hallway. So I'm gonna try these out and hopefully they're really good. And then I'll order some more from there as well. I ordered this but I just realised that it's actually this that leaked and not that the box got wet so um yeah I did get this um dog spray which is like a raspberry fragrance and honestly it does smell really nice but um the lids came loose in the thing so it's kind of leaked everywhere but that'll be fine I mean <laughs> there's literally like this tiniest amount left in there but it's okay <laughs> again this dog spray was only a pound and it's just like a dog dry shampoo and I still will use what's left in there for the dog Frank and see how I go and like I say for a pound I can just buy another one of these it's not a problem so the next thing I got was some of these glass cleaning wipes which are a pound and um, we recently like I say we've been doing up the hallway and we bought some glass um, lampshades from Ikea and aside from taking them down to wash them it's really hard to clean them because like they are glass and one of them is just clear glass so you can see if like dust settles and with us having only recently decorated um the dust is still settling so i just got some of these so that we can clean the um what am i talking about clean the uh, light shades as needed 
and yeah I just figured these were okay so that removes dirt grease fingerprints and it's pre moistened and obviously it's designed for glass so I'll be able to use these for cleaning windows and things and just anything that's glass obviously next up I got some refuge sacks basically just bin bags these are 50 litre ones so they should be really big and um, they say they're very strong so we'll give them a go I then got some treats for my cats I feel like I can get my cat to come running I don't know if you can hear her. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Hello. Oh, do you want some treats? Do you want some treats? She approves. She's such a little princess. But yeah, I just got one of these Felix goodie bags, which is just a bag of cat treats. And she definitely approves of them. She's just down here eating them now. So if you can hear a crunching noise, that's Bindi. The other two cats aren't in the bedroom right now where I am. So I'll make sure they get some of those in a little while. The next thing I got is one of these foot peels. I've actually used these before and it's basically just like an exfoliating foot treatment. You're supposed to leave it on and then your skin starts to like come off your feet within so many days but yeah you leave this on for I think like 90 minutes and it's basically just a really nice foot treatment if you've got dry feet so I figured I'd give this a go for the sake of a pound it's not that bad and yeah I'm excited to give this a go and see how it turns out to go along with that I also bought some of this hard skin reducing balm which you just use on your feet my feet do get really dry and I think it's because of the job I do it's like I'm always on my feet constantly so oh Oh, it smells like peppermint. Oh, it smells so nice. But yeah, foot cream. Next is a bubble face mask. And I've honestly wanted to try a bubble face mask for the longest time. So it just says, fully wash into pipe. Really wash your face. Wow, she wants more treats. This is not treats. This is a face mask. Thoroughly wash your face and pat dry. Open the sachet, apply a thin layer to the mask. Take care to avoid eye and lip areas. Leave the mask, blah, blah, blah. Bubbles appear. So yeah, I'm going to give this a try when I finish this video because I need to take my makeup off before I go to bed. But I'm really excited to give this a go. I'm just hoping because it says volcanic ash that it's not going to like burn my face. But it should be fine, she says. She hopes. So next, this has obviously got wet because of the thing that leaked. But this is just a go in Frank's food bowl and it's just a slow feeding insert. So it's just got like a little suction pad on the back. You stick it into his food bowl and it stops dogs from being able to guzzle their food so fast. Um, Bindi's stealing the treats. Bindi! So what was I saying? Sorry. It stops the dogs from being able to guzzle their food so fast. And I've got a French bulldog. So if he eats his food too fast, um, I do worry that it's going to make him ill. So I just figured I'd try one of these out to see if it makes any impact on him not being able to eat his food as fast. Because honestly, he does guzzle it down. He's so greedy. So I'm hoping this is going to help with that. Next up, I just got some Sure deodorant for Josh. This is just the Sure quantum dry 48 hour deodorant and i figured this is the one he usually uses anyway so i'd pick him up one of them whilst i'm at it and then this is really random but i figured the other day we found out we didn't actually have a tape measure in the house and this was only a pound and i figured you can you really go wrong with buying a cheap tape measure so for the sake of a pound i bought us a five meter long tape measure for all our house measuring needs i suppose <laughs> i don't really know what we've got to measure like we needed to measure for the blind but that's it now but at least we have a tape measure for when the future needs us to have a tape measure. So I'm going to take this out now, but this is the one that I was talking about that was £4. And this is just this mug and coaster set, which has a French bulldog on. And it just says, this one at the bottom here, it says crazy dog lady. And honestly, my dog's black, but just because it had a French bulldog on, I was like, I need to buy that. <laughs> so I got it and it's just a French bulldog. And it says dogs all over it and like i say the coaster just says crazy dog lady so i'm going to take the coaster to work and i already have a french bulldog mug at work so i'm going to leave the mug at home but yeah i'm really really chuffed with that like how cute is that so next again for my feet this is just going to seem like i have really really disgusting feet but honestly it's just because i love having pedicures and i like to use this stuff at home anyway but i just got this pedicure paddle which is like a four in one it's got a scrubber like a 
pumice stone, a file, and then also a metal file as well. So this is just really good for when you're in the shower. I think there's things on here so you can use them wet and dry, but it just says the quick step way to a complete pedicure. So I figured I would get one of these and give myself the full works of a pedicure without actually going for a pedicure. <laughs> so next up is really random, but I'm honestly been obsessed with these for the longest time. Like you've probably seen one of these in your lifetime because I feel like everyone's come across one of these, but I just got one of these head massages, which you just like, oh, it just feels so good. <laughs> so I figured I'd treat myself to a head massager and give myself a nice head massage and now I've just made my hair even more frizzy but yeah just a little head massage I feel like I could do what all the youtubers do can you see it better on here so next up we have these which is just some steam bags like I said I'm on slimming world so I figured I'd get these for days when we don't have enough as enough when we don't have as much time to cook a meal so these are just I think you get how many bags in here 30 bags in here and you just fill them with vegetables and then you put them in the microwave for so many minutes and yeah this just steams your vegetables for you so it's just a quicker and easier way of making your veg if you haven't got enough time to obviously like boil it in a pan and things so I figured I'd give these a try also I got these which are just toaster bags so these are instead of like getting out your toasting machine and things you literally just pop them in these bags and it makes you a toasty and they're reusable and they're just so quick and easy at least I think, oh yeah, yeah, they're reusable. <laughs> but my gran has these and honestly, they're so good. And on Slimming World, I can use bread for my healthy extras. So I'm thinking I might make myself a toasty one day. And these are just a much quicker and easier way of doing that. So yeah, I picked up these two. The next thing, honestly, I wasn't expecting it to be as big as this. I thought it was going to be a smaller one because this is only a pound. But this is the Carex Squishies Drumsticks. Um, this is bath and shower gel. Oh. That smells so good but yeah so you can use this i think you can use this in the shower as shower gel or you can put it in your bath and use it as like bubble bath but i'm so excited to use this because honestly it smells incredible like i always buy the fun scented fun scented like i'm 12. <laughs> i also always buy the like sweet scented ones of these so i get like the imperial leather ones usually which are like palmer violets and things like that but i figured i'd try the squishies one because why not and honestly yeah you can't go wrong this is only a pound and this is a 500 milliliter bottle as well so that'll last quite a while and yeah oh i might have to go jump in the shower after this just to use this because honestly it smells so good so next up i got this which is the malibu sunburn relief and every summer no matter what i do i always seem to get burnt at some point and it's usually just my shoulders because I'm quite fair skinned anyway. So I tend to get at least some sunburn, even if I wear sun cream, whether it be like my nose or something. So I figured I'd just pick this up um, just in case. And even if I don't, I can just use it on my face after a nice hot day, just to make sure that my skin stays hydrated after I've been in the sun. So I've only got two more things to show you. So one of them is this, which is just a, This is just like a lazy person's vegetable chopper and this is for like garlic and onions and things. I'm not actually sure how well this is going to work, but I figured I would give it a go. I assume you just pop the things in there. Wait a minute. How does that go? I can't. Does it not go? Oh, yeah. So you just pop like the onions or garlic in there and just press this and it just comes down and chops it. So I'm going to give this a go. I think it's maybe just a gimmick, but it looked fun and I hate chopping up onions, I'll be honest. So hopefully this little guy is my new best friend. So the last thing I got in here is all wrapped up. And so this is a candle. And honestly, I wasn't expecting it to be this big because it was like three pounds, I think. But this is a candle factory candle and it's like the same size as a medium candle yankee candle and this is the espresso martini scent so this says it lasts for 32 hours and honestly i was expecting this to just smell like fresh coffee and i really hope it does because then i can burn it in my kitchen because i love the smell of coffee but oh mm -hmm. yeah it kind of smells like chocolate but coffee at the same time it honestly smells incredible but yeah this is the last thing i bought and
and yeah that is my box empty now minus the cat treats which I popped back in there because the cat was trying to steal them um I'll take them out now but like I say this is my box empty that's everything I bought and yeah honestly I can't stop smelling that <laughs> smells so good anyway like i said i'm really happy with everything that i purchased from cherries i say purchase i was gifted them but everything that they've gifted me i am very very grateful and like i said all the things you got for the equivalent of 50 pounds is just incredible so i definitely recommend you guys check them out they sell all sorts of things from like crafts for like children's crafts easter eggs they were selling mother's day gifts on there candles they sell things for cleaning your house personal care items just food products they sell like chocolate sweets honestly everything that you would probably find in home bargains and b&m but on this website so like i say i definitely definitely need to stop saying definitely definitely in all my videos but <laughs> i really do recommend that you check out cherries and like i said if you do want to check them out and you do want to do some shopping on their website if you use my code which is page louise 20 you can get yourself 20 percent off the only thing is you do have to use the link down below in the description box to take you to the app and then when you type in the code it'll give you 20 percent off your purchase and honestly i really really recommend like i will be shopping at cherries more often because it was just so convenient so easy and even if you just need some shower gel and some toothpaste delivering like if you don't have time to go to the shop you can just get it on next day delivery so it's definitely worth it and the prices are just the same if not cheaper than what you would pay in home bargains and b&m and honestly i love home bargains and b&m so the fact that i can get it online is just insane <laughs> But anyway, that's everything for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Please make sure to like if you have and subscribe to see more videos from me. Also hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload and I'll see you guys in my next video.